Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. We've got a lot of exciting updates to delve into today, so let's dive right in without further ado. SpaceX is revving up for the final pre-flight launch preparations ahead of its fourth Starship flight. Just yesterday, Booster 11 was carefully transported to the launch site in anticipation of the upcoming test. SpaceX chief Elon Musk shared on his platform X that the fourth Starship flight could be slated for anywhere between three to five weeks from now, effectively ruling out a launch this month. Earlier today, we saw Booster 11 lifted onto the orbital launch mount by the chopstick arms. Meanwhile, Starship S-30, fresh from completing its static fire test, has returned to the build site, etching its name in history as the final Starship to undergo such testing at the launch site. However, progress often comes with bittersweet moments. SpaceX crews wasted no time in dismantling the last surviving suborbital test stand, Pad B, as construction for the second tower at Starbase is already underway. It's a poignant reminder of the transient nature of things here at the South Texas spaceport, signaling the end of an era. As we look ahead, multiple potential road closure schedules and notices of delays have been posted for what promises to be a bustling week. A Marine Safety Information Bulletin has been issued for May 16, hinting at an upcoming wet dress rehearsal. During these road delays, SpaceX is set to commence the transportation of tower segments for the second Starship Tower from the Port of Brownsville to the Sanchez site. Additionally, Starship S-31 has been transported to Massey's site in preparation for its cryogenic test. Despite the flurry of activity at the Starbase, SpaceX remains focused on its launch schedule. After successfully completing its 48th mission of the year on Thursday, the company is gearing up for its 49th mission of 2024. Another Starlink mission is scheduled for tomorrow night from SLC-40 in Florida. Don't forget to check out the link provided at the end of the video for the live stream. And that wraps up today's video. Thank you all for tuning in, and until next time, take care and goodbye.